exercise is not equal. While it is important to remain active, most people call me because they've tried things before but never got fit. I want to show you some things you can do to work into your exercise routine to help you lose more fat today. So much time and attention is devoted to the middle and upper abs, let's work the lower abs. First, for beginners, we're gonna start with the leg lifts. Lay flat on the back on your mat and take your hands, put them to the side. From here, we're gonna keep your legs straight, lift your legs up about two to three inches, hold it for a second or two, lowering them back down slowly, just touching the floor, then back up and repeat. Then we're gonna flutter the legs, which is the same as a leg lift, but we're gonna alternate between right and left side. Just pulsate your legs back and forth a couple inches, working the different hemispheres, the left and the right side of the abs individually. Do that 25 to 45 times. Then jump right up and let's do some vertical leg raises. And we're gonna do this with a bent knee, holding yourself up in the vertical leg raise apparatus. Make sure that your elbows are close to the body. Body is straight and head is straight forward. From here, take your knees, pull them up at least to 90 degrees, but preferably even higher to your sternum or even your chin. Hold it for two seconds and down slowly and you're gonna feel the burn and the tightness of the lower abs. Next, for more advanced, we're gonna do a super crunch. One of my favorites working with clients, lay flat on your back and I like to take my hands and put them right underneath my lower spine. From here, I'm gonna perform a leg lift where I lift my legs up about two inches while at the same time doing a crunch where I'm lifting up my shoulders and upper body about two inches. Make sure you keep your head back, looking up towards the ceiling so you don't have any neck strain. From there, into a hanging vertical leg raise, a lot like its cousin where you're supported. But now we're gonna work a little bit harder because you're going to be suspended. By keeping your body nice and straight without rocking, you're gonna be working your core a little bit more. Take your knees, pull them up as high as you can, at least to the chin, preferably to the eyes. Hold it for a second or two and lower yourself back down slowly. And lastly, we're gonna do an oldie but goodie, the ab wheel. An ab wheel can be purchased for about $10 or so. Hold on to the wheel, start on your knees and roll your body all the way out. It is important to try to keep your upper torso as straight as possible and lower your body as low to the floor as possible. Bring yourself all the way up again, and each time you do so, inhale on the way up, deep breath in on the way out. If you have joint pain, shoulders, hips, knees, back, neck, stop. Do not do any exercise. Contact my office, set up a private fat loss and fitness consultation. I wanna give you the right recommendations to help you do the right workout for your body to help you drop more fat today.